You can record too with your camera. <laughs> I like taking these off because you can't really see my eyes. There's so much glare. I have my camera. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's been playing with it all day. She loves it. I think it's a really awesome toy. I mentioned it in previous video, but happy Vlogmas day 11. Tomorrow's the last day. I think tomorrow I'm gonna do a holiday get ready with me. I'm gonna spray tan at home using Mind Tan uh, at home spray tan kit, as well as color my brows in with the usual Amazon kit that I always use. Do my hair. That's for tomorrow's video. That's for tomorrow's video. <laughs> Look at this little vlogger right here. You are recording? Let me see. She's recording too. You're vlogging. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> so I completely forgot. You know, let me take it. There's like this huge glare, and I feel like it's gonna. Even though I love these so much, don't mind the hair. I was debating to do a clean with me video today, or what kind of video to do. But then I'm like, you know what? Let me do a mini holiday house tour. I keep seeing those. Even though I don't have a bunch of stuff up, it's. Pretty minimal, it's not like crazy Christmas, slap in your face Christmas, but it's enough to make Mama, it feel like Christmas have and homey. Cameras. And then I remembered that I completely forgot to put out their train that goes under the tree and I have this parrot sitting right next to me that's repeating What train? Think. You'll see, I gotta get it from the basement, I completely forgot. It is loud yeah, and obnoxious and falls apart and they might start crying. Mama, Mm-hmm, so I think I'm gonna go do that and then do like a little mini holiday house tour of everything Are you gonna that do I have that up. now? Because I don't think I'm gonna be adding to my Christmas decor. I think this is basically I kind of did the table a little bit just so it looks a little Christmassy But let me get the train table. We're gonna set it up together and then I'll do the little tour Today is Wednesday. I have a few packages coming in today. I'm super excited for like misguided first ever time shopping at misguided Ooh. This is mm -hmm. So let me go bring the train. Yeah, I'm gonna go bring the train. Just is gonna be so. That's good. what I'm going to say. What are you gonna say? That uh, what no, that was that's what. Yeah, that was your guess. Yeah. yeah. That I wanted to say. Cute. This little mug is so cozy. Okay. Well, that kind of sucks because this main train right here, the battery is dead. I'm not sure if we have any around the house. I'll have to ask my husband. Um, they're like the really, the bigger ones, the big ones. I'm not sure. We do have double A's, but those won't fit in here. So we'll see if we do later on. I'll show a clip. I was pretty excited for the kids to just like play around with it and see it go around and around the tree. But this is essentially the train right here. These guys go up and down, these little elves. And then this is just like a uh, just like a regular cabin, some cold. These guys are here. And then Santa's, this broke, obviously we taped it and it has a light in the front and it sings Christmas, a Christmas song going round and round. And it also comes with a remote that you can um, make it go forward, backward, stop. Usually we keep this tree in the dining room. I feel like I said that so many times throughout Vlogmas. But for now, it is in this room right here. So now I'm just gonna do like a quick little Christmas house tour. I have the tree in our family room. Adds nice coziness to it. That pillow I've had for ages and ages. I do have to update our couch pillows right here. Just get like some more Christmassy ones. I've had these for ages, but I figured not this year. This throw right here is actually from Alvi. It's really cozy. It works for any season. And then we have the kids station right here. All these little knickknacks are actually from Dollar Tree. And um, uh, my camera is from Amazon. It is from Amazon. You have your little bakery, cute little situation. They like playing with them once in a while. They have their own mini tree right here. Kind of like makes everything a little bit more Christmassier. So that's all we have for this room. And then we have our kitchen right off the family room. It's like the center of the entire house. This is not finished, this uh, pellet insert that we got so far, but I have our stockings hanging here with yeah, our letter toys. board and the Christmas cards that we have so far. I'm not sure when I'm, where I'm gonna keep the Christmas cards, but for now I'm gonna, they're here for now. The stocking stuffers I got from Home Goods, as well as this one in the middle, super pretty. And the other two are from BJ's, they came in a pack of two. The kids' stockings are already stuffed. 
With what? What do we put in your stockings? Toys. Mm-hmm. Bunch of toys that you can't peek. We got our Santa, I mean snowman right here. And then we have our doorway, entryway into our dining room. If you watched my video, I showed a video on how to do this garland right here. I added some more greenery to it. Super festive, I love doing this. This is my second year doing it. And then this is the dining room. This is how I'm gonna keep it, nice and simple. I do have the chair covers on for daily use, but I'm gonna keep this nice and simple. Just added some greenery in the middle. Super bright in here, so it's kind of hard to see. And then these trees I got from Target, all of them. I initially wanted the clear glass trees, but they were all sold out, completely sold out, and I wanted to do like a faux fur throw uh, throughout the table and make it look super cozy. Maybe next year if I can get my hands on them or if I'm still into that. But this is just your basic simple Christmas layout. Add some pomegranates if you want for some pops of color. These, all these trees actually light up. And then here on the window, just hung little mini wreaths. Came in a pack of three from Walmart with some ribbon. It's kind of hard to see everything because it is super, super bright in this room. Going back into the kitchen, there's really not much here other than this little section thing going on here. I kind of kept the pumpkins. They're still in great shape, so I'm not gonna throw them out. And then I just have my coffee station, which adds pops of color to my kitchen, but that's about it. And then this is our main formal living room. It's not done yet, I'm still furnishing it. But this is where we keep our main tree. I was debating putting a mistletoe right here when you first walk in on this light right here, and I still might do it. You know one of those kissing balls that they sell? So I might still do that. Don't mind all the things like this. Like we're still finishing stuff up in this house. We've only lived here, I think this is our third Christmas here. Takes a while to finish stuff up. This is just a tree that I made years and years and years ago. It's like the green styrofoam with pine cones that I painted. And this is super great. Got it off Amazon. It's a Himalayan salt oil diffuser, essential oil diffuser. And then here's our little piano with our nativity set that we got from Target. Super cute. I absolutely love this set. think is really cute and then I have these trees to kind of help everything all the colors come together in champagne and blush tones but the detail on this is so nice I got this from the store at home and then that one's from Burlington all the way in the back but how pretty are these so that's it for this little station here not much else and then you have the main tree right here with all of our presents as well as the garland the tree is super tall just barely any space up top when we put on the star. But I really love the tree. Here's like a full length shot. This, the kids keep messing with it so the little ribbon came off. If you watched my video, I wrapped Christmas presents. Nothing crazy, I just went with like your basic Christmas colors this year. My whole theme this year is champagne and wine. My mom did drop off presents already for the kids. Um, but I absolutely love this wrapping paper. They do sell it at Target. It is very sturdy and it is you could you could use really dark green velvet You could use black velvet like you could use any color with this wrapping paper. It's very nice This one is from Walmart really messy because the glitter does fall off, but it's really pretty and then this one's very interesting It's like a it's like a weird material. It doesn't rip. It's just very interesting. Like I said, my theme this year is champagne and wine. The only pops of color I have are these wine ornaments that I got from Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby has some stunning ornaments. Definitely check out Hobby Lobby. I got this one from there as well. It's like a velvet with beads all over it and sequins, if it focuses. I think it is so pretty. And then this one's from Hobby Lobby also. I mean, the detail on their ornaments is, they are messy because there are so many beads. You wanna be careful. This one's also from Hobby Lobby. And this one as well. I mean, look at these, so pretty. Just these unique ornaments that you probably wouldn't find anywhere else. But, and I also got this one. This one's also one of my favorites that I found at Hobby Lobby this year. It's like these big snowflakes. Mm-hmm, like that one. So that's our tree situation. It was kind of hard to decorate it because it's so sparse, but I'm actually really happy with how it came out. There's like not too much going on, but enough to, it's gonna be a hot mess trying to take it down. That's not gonna be fun. I'll probably do a video on that. And this is the garland. I did add some more greens that I had from outside. 
but this is basically what it is and if you can see he'll peep little dried oranges when i light this up at night it looks really pretty i also did a video on how to put this together the garland strand was only 13 dollars or something like that as well as that one i got two one for here and one for here but here's a little close-up for you guys And then I have my advent calendar right here that we do every single night before bed. Aviana makes sure to remind me. What day are we on today? Yeah, yeah we're on day 11. This is also a DIY, really cute. Can do it every single year. But that's it for the Christmas house tour, you guys. Nothing crazy, nothing excessive. Just like enough to make it feel pretty Christmassy around here. I do absolutely love Christmas. So this is something that I really enjoy, decorating the house for Christmas. Let me know what you guys think, your thoughts down below. I love watching videos like this. Stay tuned for the last day of Vlogmas. I'll be announcing the winners for Lashify giveaway the 13th on the first video that I did. Vlogmas day one, that's where I'll be announcing the winner. This is gonna be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow.